not Meghan Markle, Prince Harry's happiness depends a lot on King Charles, royal family historian explains how. Prince Harry celebrated his 40th birthday in California, reflecting on his past as a royal and his strained family relationships. Living with Meghan Markle and their children, he expresses enthusiasm for the future, aiming to create a better world while missing support from his father, King Charles. Hello viewers, please remember to subscribe and click on the notifications bell icon, so you will be notified whenever we upload new cookies about the British royal family. On September 15, Prince Harry celebrated his 40th birthday in California, far from his previous life in the British royal family. Ten years ago, he was a working royal, had just finished his military service and launched the successful Invictus Games in London. Back then, his father, now King Charles, was by his side, often praising his achievements. Today, Harry lives in the United States with his wife, Meghan Markle, and their two children, Archie, aged five, and Lilibet, aged three. While he enjoys walks on the beach and casual dinners with friends in Montecito, his relationships with his father and brother, Prince William, are reportedly strained. This tension grew after Harry's Netflix series and the release of his memoir, which many believe widened the rift within the royal family. Royal historian Dr. Tessa Dunlop believes that Harry would be happier if his father showed more support. Service, then and now, makes Harry happy. The big difference is ten years ago Harry had his dad by his side. Well done, darling boy was Charles's response to Harry's first Invictus performance, she told the Mirror. Nowadays, the prince is a seasoned performer, but I suspect he'd be far happier if his father was still cheering him from the sidelines. A landmark birthday, is always a good place to start. Fingers crossed the king found the time to reach out to his son on his birthday of all days, she added. As he turns 40, Prince Harry is enthusiastic about the future. He has told the BBC that, although he felt anxious upon reaching 30, he now looks forward to this new chapter in his life and aims to continue doing good in the world. He also believes that becoming a father to two delightful children has transformed his perspective and made him more dedicated to creating a better world. Prince Harry celebrated his 40th birthday on 15 September and received messages from Kate Middleton and William who took to social media to wish the exiled prince. Kate and William's message said, wishing a happy 40th birthday to the Duke of Sussex. Posted to Kensington Palace social media channels, the message was also reposted from a message sent earlier by the King, which contained slightly different text. It read, wishing the Duke of Sussex a very happy 40th birthday today. However, the Daily Beast quoted a friend of the King's saying they expect Prince Harry and King Charles would speak by phone later in the day. Meanwhile, the DB reported that despite sending the Duke and Duchess of Wales sent birthday wishes to Harry on social media, Prince William has no interest in restoring contact with Prince Harry. Amid the royal drama storm and struggle to make peace with new life in California, Prince Harry is celebrating his 40th birthday on Sunday September 15. Prince Harry was born as a rebellious adult who faced criticism, during his teenage for wearing a controversial Nazi uniform at a costume party. Decades later, nothing has changed much, as the Duke of Sussex has been impugned for his strained ties with the royals after marrying Meghan Markle in 2018. As Prince Harry turns 40 today, wishes are pouring in to greet him with a happy birthday. Let's take a look at the key moments in Prince Harry's life with these 10 photos. Prince Harry, also known as the Duke of Sussex, was born on 15th of September, 1984 as the younger kid of King Charles III and late Diana, Princess of Wales. At that time, he was fifth in the line of succession to the British throne. After a three-year gap, the royal family publicly extended birthday wishes to Prince Harry. Prince William and Kate Middleton shared a message on the social media platform X, formerly Twitter. 
The Prince and Princess of Wales wished Harry on his fortieth birthday while sharing a wish by the royal family. William and Kate added their note to wish the Duke of Sussex, wishing a happy fortieth birthday to the Duke of Sussex. This is the first time since Harry and Meghan's controversial interview with Oprah Winfrey in 2021 that the royals have openly acknowledged his birthday. On August 4, Meghan Markle celebrated her 43rd birthday. Interestingly, Harry's wife did not receive any public wish from any members of the royal family at that time. It was the second consecutive year that Meghan did not receive any wishes from her in-laws. A lot happened during Prince Harry's 40th birthday celebration on Sunday September 15. The heir to the throne, Prince William, and his wife, Kate Middleton's public acknowledgement of Prince Harry's birthday came as a surprise for many. However, this was not the only highlight of the day. The other big thing that happened on September 15 was the $10 million, equal to 83.8 .8 crore, amount the Duke of Sussex inherited as a gift from his late great-grandmother. According to the Times, Prince Harry received an extraordinarily generous gift of $10 million from a family trust fund set up by Queen Elizabeth the Queen Mother when he was 10 years old. The report also added that Harry's great-grandmother reportedly deposited an estimated £19 million in a fund in 1994. The trust ensured that she could pass on a tax-free lump sum to her great-grandchildren. Prince Harry and Prince William are eligible to claim the money deposited in the trust. The two brothers reportedly claimed the money in two installments, the first one on their 21st birthday and the second on their 40th birthday. The two received $7.9 million collectively on their 21st birthday. On their 40th birthday, Prince William and Prince Harry will receive another $10.5 million installment. There was a trust fund set up at the time. It was a way in which the Queen Mother could set aside money for when her great-grandchildren were older and a way of passing a slice of her estate down in a tax-efficient way, the Times quoted a former palace, aide, told the newspaper. Prince Harry, on his birthday, received wishes from Prince William, King Charles III, and Kate Middleton. The public wishes from the royal family members after a break of two years can be seen as a hint of reconciliation between the two sides. Wishing the Duke of Sussex a very happy 40th birthday today. Wrote the official ex-account of the royal family, which Charles' office at Buckingham Palace runs. Before marrying Meghan Markle, Diana's brother Earl Spencer was asked to speak to Harry about his relationship. He even advised Harry to reconsider his decision as he thought Meghan would struggle to fit in with the royal family, Tom Bauer claimed in his book Revenge, Meghan, Harry and the War Between the Windsors, according to the Mirror. After being let down by the royal family, Prince Harry introduced Meghan to his mother's family, assuming that her friends and loved ones would see a similarity between Diana and his fiance, reported Mirror. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like this video and drop comments, and most importantly don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything.